Good afternoon, Marife. Yes, ma'am. Good afternoon. Can you tell us about yourself? My name is Marife Torres of Lange. I am 37 years old from Baligyan Hapong Lago, Sunday North, Philippines. I, I am a single mother. I have eight years old son. Okay. And, uh, he was with my, my mom. I am flexible, willing to work under pressure. I am, I can cook, I can clean, I can iron, and I can, I can laundry. Okay. I am, I am willing to work in any kind of work. Okay. I have a few questions for you to answer. Let's yes, start. Why do you want to work as a maid? I have to earn more because I need to provide the needs of my family. Why you choose Malaysia? I think they are, they are good people. How are you qualified for this job? Because I know myself and I know uh, I am qualified for the job, for any job. May I know what was your educational level is? I, I reach a uh, third year college now. Okay. Studying in Sorry, called the Nordic College of Culture and Technology. Okay, you are college undergraduate, correct? Yes, ma'am. What was your latest working experience? Uh, I worked in Kingdom of Saudi Arabia okay. from 2016 to 2019. All right. Have you worked other country before? Yes, I went to UAA and uh, Kingdom of uh, State of Kuwait. Okay. Do you have experience of taking care of babies? Yes, ma'am. Whose babies did you take care before? Uh, children of my employer, ma'am. Do you have experience assisting elderly? Yes, ma'am. Whose elderly was that? Was my father, ma'am. Do you have any other special skills? Yes, ma'am. Like? I can teach children music and uh, educational. Okay. So, I can do. Okay. You you can do tutor to them. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Are you willing to learn new skills? Yes, ma'am. Are you willing to work with a family where the mother-in-law or any relative stay together? Yes, ma'am. Currently, are you still working now? Uh, applying, ma'am. Looking for a job. Okay. Do you know how to cook? Yes, ma'am. What sort of food can you cook? I cook uh, Filipino dish and Arabian. Are you aware that you will have to do washing, cleaning, ironing, and cooking? Yes, ma'am. Very much aware. From all the house chores that I have mentioned to you, which do you like most? All of them. Okay. If ever you will come and work, who will take care of your kid? My mother. You are not allowed to use handphone during working hours? No problem. You are only allowed to use handphone after you finish all the works and when going to bed? No problem. You are strictly needed to surrender the handphone to your employer in the morning and your employer will return back to you once you're going to bed. It's okay, ma'am. If ever your employer finds out that you're abusing of using your handphone and it's affected your working performance, your employer will confiscate your handphone. No problem. Instead, your employer will allow you to call to your family three times in a month. You only allowed to bring normal phone and you are not allowed to bring smartphone. Are you no agreed problem. for the terms and condition? No problem. Are you agreed to the rules and regulation for the handphone? Yes, ma'am. How many years is the contract as you agreed and understands? Two years contract, ma'am. Can you describe for us your attitude? I am flexible, hardworking. How can you assure to us that you will work hard in Malaysia? I know myself, ma'am, and I've been working hard ever since. Okay, can you promise not to use the house telephone without the permission of your employer? Yes, ma'am. Can you promise not to put on makeup but to dress properly while work? Yes, ma'am. Can you promise not to ask for advance salary from your employer under any circumstances? Yes, ma'am. Do you really understand some of the rules and regulation of the agency? Yes, ma'am. Do you pay any placement fee for you to come to Malaysia to work as a maid? No, ma'am. Do you have any history of sickness, breast cancer, or any other illness? No, ma'am. Do you suffer from any skin diseases, allergies, or physical defects? No, ma'am. Do you smoke? 
No, ma'am. Have you undergone any operation before? Yes, ma'am. What kind of operation? Cesarean section. When was that? 2011 and 2016. Okay. Are you medically fit or are you fit to work? I am fit to work. Are you in any medication right now? No, ma'am. Are you allergic with any food? No, ma'am. Are you prepared to work for the employer with different races? Yes, ma'am. Are you prepared to eat the type of food taken or given by your employer? Yes, ma'am. Are you afraid alone in the house? No, ma'am. Are you afraid of dogs or other pets? No, ma'am. Can you promise to work according to instruction from your employer? Yes, ma'am. Do you have any family members working in Malaysia? No, ma'am. Okay, we have finished our question section. Marife, let's proceed for case study. Okay. I have a case study for you and I want you to respond truthfully. Yes, ma'am. Upon arrival in Malaysia within six months only, if in case one of your family members passed away, what will you do? I will call them and send them on. Okay, if in case right now your employer is watching you, what do you want to tell them? Why do you need to hire you, Marife? I am different from the others. I am flexible, I'm willing to work under pressure, and I am a hard worker. Tell us about yourself again. My name is Mary Pertoris of Lampe. I am 37 years old from Baligian Hapong Gagos and Milwaukee. I am a single mother with an 8 year, eight years old son. I and, am flexible, okay. willing to work under pressure, okay. approachable, respectful, and hard working. Okay, and why do you want to work in Malaysia as domestic helper? Because I need to earn more money to provide the needs of my family. Okay, thank you very much. Marife, we will update to your agency if there is any selection made by the employer. Okay, ma'am.